Firstly, farmers have been calling for this meeting, as we all know, and after a very long time. Has this allowed you to reach common ground with Agribank? Yes, thank you for having us. Um, I think the meeting took place today at about 3 o'clock this afternoon. And the, I think we, there is a light at the end of the tunnel. I think we need to thank the bank for really opening up the doors wide enough to even elevate the meeting to a board level in terms of us discussing the issues that we need, to, the petting issues that we, the farmers, are facing. So it, really, it was really an, uh, a very good meeting. Uh, there is a lot of fruitful discussions that have taken place, although at this point in time, a lot of them are really under wrap in terms of confidentiality. Mm -hmm. But I think there is really a green light in terms of the bank's approach now. I think there is, they have a, more, a much more softened approach to the issue now, and I think we're very glad for that. It is being said that farmers are reluctant to pay back the money loaned to Agribank. Mm -hmm. um, what is the case there? What's the issue there? Mm -hmm. The issue in terms of repayment, I think we want to set the record straight. As farmers, we have a, an obligation to the bank. The bank needs to operate sustainably. And for the bank to operate sustainably, they really need the hands of the, all the stakeholders, including the farmers, to make that. So in terms of non-payment of farmers, is not the issue at all. There is, a, there is a willingness to play, but it's to find the right, the right mechanisms in terms of how do we deal with the current situation, given the various factors that are, comp that, that are affecting the farmers not to pay on time. So the payment is not really the issue. I think there is a very strong commitment from the farmers. And that was also alluded by the CEO of the bank himself in terms of the amount of money that was collected through debt collectors over the past couple of months here. Mm -hmm. And finally, just looking at the current situation, what's the way forward? I think the way forward, we have reached a level of consensus in terms of finding a, a platform, a framework under which we ourselves as affected farmers mm -hmm. can start now, formally start engaging the bank at a level where we can start getting sustainable solutions to this problem. And, and the problem is not just a, a, a issue of payment of the current liquidity situation the bank finds itself, but it's to find a amicable, sustainable solution to make sure that black uh, commercial farmers in the future can have a, a, much, a, a much more relaxed way of actually dealing with these particular issues that they're having.